Good evening YouTube. I'm late today, I'm telling you. I spent about two hours trying to reset my network. Oh, it was great fun. But I'm there, hopefully, touch wood. Yeah. Release day. Yeah, and what a release day it is. Now, let's face it guys, you can go back on the last few videos I've done with my big highlight of what's out in June and look for the 16th, you'll see it there. And you will see what actually came out today, I should say the 15th, not the 16th, but there you go. But some the highlights, Armour of God 2, Operation Condor came out today. Oh, I really, really want that. I'll get it. Birds of Prey came out today, and that was with a 4K steelbook, a HMV exclusive 4K steelbook, 4K and Blu-ray as well. I'm going to have to get hold of that because my daughter loves that film. And the 4K for Blues Brothers came out today as well. Let me know in the comments down below if any of you picked that up because it's a really cool cover. Doolittle, which I'm going to give a chance to. See what big Paulie thinks as well. That's just 4K and Blu-ray. Ghostbusters, the 4K steelbooks, Ghostbusters 1 and 2, and the normal steelbooks that came out today as well. If you pre-ordered those, it's Abby, you jammy sods. Uh, Boys 2 Brahms, I'm not sure if I'll give that the time of day, but it's, you know, I'm sure my daughter would like it. Call of the Wild was another highlight with Harrison Ford, even though he ain't like Kermit's ghost says, he's not even in it for the first fucking hour. And one that sneaked in under the radar that only appeared on the release schedules a couple of days ago, the 4K version of the new version of Shaft came out today. So they, they really pushed that one out quick. So not too bad. And that's only a little bit of what actually came out. Next week, it's quieting down. There's some nostalgia in next week. which is some, There's some good bits there. But my highlights will be the remake of Emma, which is the new one, and Death Ship, which is a real classic old one. I really want that. As for sales, nothing else has started, nothing else has perked its way up. But the main good thing is the majority of the CEXs are now open. Go on their website, go to the top, click stores, then put your postcode in. It'll tell you if your nearest one is open. And all mine are. Now, I was going to have a big, busy week medically, but I was told Friday that I have not self isolated enough to have my operational procedure on Tuesday. How could somebody told me to fucking do it? They won't let me in the hospital unless I've, I've basically sat on my ass for two weeks not going out. Mm. Right, so we'll see. So tomorrow I'm free, so I'm hoping to get out to CEX and have a little look around. Hopefully I'll do a bit of filming and get something down on the camera for you. Really do hope I do. But films are coming to me. now. Everyone knows Jason Laverick. He's the one who uh, always sends me nice parcels. I send him uh, slip covers, he sends me parcels. It's always a good thing. First one that he sent me was the Clint Eastwood Western Collection. That's got Pale Rider, The Outlaw, Josie Wells, and Unforgiven. Very cool, actually. So I'm really happy with that one. Next one that's not on any listings, so you can't really catalog it, is a little bonus disc for Keep Take the 3D Journey. It's got quite a few highlights from films in there that's a really cool thing to have in your collection if you have 3d beans holiday yeah mr beans holiday i've got another mr bean somewhere but yeah i had to have that very cool uh bumping up the other disney's i managed to get a hold of lion king 3 that means i've got one two and three now yeah cool. you got out i've got to have it now and I will be picking it up 3D because you know what I'm like. But yeah, Frozen 2, so that's another one of the Disney classics into my collection. I will be filming that before the end of the week. But as you can see, yet again, I'm moving shit around. Um, um, there's going to be a huge load of building and shit going on in this room. Um, I'm moving where my monitors are. I'll be drilling the back of the desk. I'll be doing all sorts. I'll show you exactly what I've done when I'm finished. The tower for the PC is going to be going somewhere else and it's going to have ventilation fans and everything. So, oh, I'm going all out on this. So it's going to look good. Um, obviously, I had to pick this up. The colours on this film look amazing. I have not watched this yet, but I can't wait. And, you know, you know I'm, I'm going to get it 3D, on I? And one from my daughter. Um, the Office. Season 9. Now, this is an American one, but it's region 3. And it's something that CX do actually trade in because they got they got it on there. But um, I don't know whether I'll keep this yet because I'm I, I would want to get the entire collection. And if they're not all separately available or easily or cheaply available, 
no use me having series just nine because this is so funny I want the lot we'll have to wait and see watch this space that's me pickups now let's have a quick where did I put them the prizes for this Friday I went for top of the film you know top of the film studio and bottom of the film studio doesn't matter if it's the same studio so the pinnacle of a film studios films I put Dark Knight and Suicide Squad and then the shit side of one <laughs> I put Amazing Spider-Man 2 and Fantastic Four Rise of the Silver Surfer so someone's going to be happy to win the bottom two and someone's not going to be happy to win the other two so I thought a bit, a bit twisty but that should prize this for this Friday now we are 13 subscribers only 13 away from 400 I love all you guys there's so many nice comments it's a really nice community to be in I love doing all the research and the information I put out I'm trying to mix it up as much as I can I'm finally going to get this lot laid out how I want it and I can't wait cost a bit of money but I'll get it all sorted and then hopefully you also what I have I'll get it all set up exactly how I want then we'll end up moving and I'll have to pack it all up that's my luck but we'll see what happens. I've always got more films coming in. I'm going to trade a few in when I go to CEX. And so I'll probably come back with a big pile of films because that's what I'm like. I'm stupid. But we'll see. But when I get to 400, 13 left. Right? So tell your brother, tell your mother, tell your friends, tell your son. Tell the fucking postman to subscribe to me. And remember, you go onto Facebook, go to Peter, Blu-ray Bullet Brit Ainsley. On the t-shirt by doing that you were entered into the competitions and it costs nothing if anyone doesn't want a few blu-rays you know bear in mind guys this is what i gave away last friday just last friday and if you think that was good you wait till fucking christmas i've got some plans oh <laughs> i've got some plans you're gonna love me then I would hope to be at near 500 by Christmas and then we have a real party then but there you go as soon as I hit 400 there will be a surprise prize a surprise prize yeah surprise prize and that'd be a good one <laughs> take care guys I'll get this over to you as quick as I can because I've had network shit all day but I will be back tomorrow take care